level. Spring training in the bigs is almost here. Prep, baseball, and of course, the little guys. Now at Lago Seco Park, it was an opening night to remember for Riviera Little League. One that the man who invented the light bulb would appreciate if he was still here today. And then the big guy said to me, Oh, let there be light. For years, Riviera Little League has been a mainstay in the city of Torrance. And for the first time ever, the league that has been around for over 50 years can host night games. A couple years ago, we had over 600 kids in our league and we had spillover games over at South High on the girls' softball field. And each year we went from one game per team to six games. You're playing at South High. To accommodate the hundreds of kids, league president Brent Hannon and fellow board member Mark Enuma went to the city of Torrance in hopes of finding a solution. It was either a brand new field or lights. Myself and Mark Enuma, fellow board member, went to the city and basically said, hey, we need a third field or we need lights. And they said, you want to get a third field, you, you, you have a better chance getting lights. We said, what do we got to do to get the lights? And basically it was go door to door to 30 neighbors and get 100% approval for them to sign off. Myself, Marky Numer, and our two boys went door to door. Uh, basically begged and pleaded and said, hey, sign off, it's for the kids. Once they tackled that obstacle, it was now on to fundraising solely for the purpose of making the lights project a reality. Madam Chairman we would like to reward another check for $1,000 to give you a little late, along with a whole bunch of uh, equipment. That we and the response has been huge. You know, it has just for the fact that the games will all be played here. I think that was the biggest thing because even though South was very nice to us by allowing us to play games there, it's very windy there. It's all dirt infield. There's no bathrooms. So for the parents just to be able to have their kids play at these locations, there's huge support by the parents. One, a two, a three, let there be. 28 years ago, the Chicago Cubs played their first night game in history at Wrigley Field. And just like the Cubs, for the first time ever, Riviera Little League can do the same. What a BEA beautiful park. Congrats to Riviera Little League.